We are on to the final, no, semifinals between Drone and and Google Frog, which Anakin needs to update the tournament brackets. And we are on Altair Crossing, which is the semifinals map. It is. Oh boy, we have not seen Drone at all today. I'm sure you might have, but I think I. I oh what? What drone would? Oh, I have for Proxy a second I thought spider. He... Yeah, I thought I was gonna go for a comp push. He's got battle comp, and he's thinking he's, he's gonna morph going comp. To. No, he's doing it. He is doing it. He's coming for a yeah. comp push. Google Frog, on the other hand, recon is standard recon LPB. Commander. I think he will just uh, going to demolish Google Frog now. Venom's on top of a battle comp. Yeah, I agree. I liked it. This is how you should oh, play with these Riot type Cannon of maps. as well. Oh, nice! Love seeing Riot Cannon. I was actually talking to I a new player the other day who was curious about what to get for his commander. And he's wondering between different weapons, and I said, "Riot Cannon is a good choice," but he didn't believe me because it's a good choice. Have you shotgun or laser or shotgun, uh, they're laser, all good. Auto repair Riot on a battle commander is always good. Yep, yeah, that that's also true. Now he has to deal with skirmishes. This is the right reaction from Google Frog by yeah, spamming Rockers. Once spiders come out, the only thing you really have to deal with is Rockers. And Rockers will deal with it very well. But Glaives, no. Glaives, not so much. Rockers, okay, now he just needs a dozen. And uh, LPB is that up. Particle beam, that particle beam. That's the only chance that Google Frog has. I think. Okay, drone. This is, this is an all in from drone. He doesn't even have any really more units coming in. One more Venom coming in. And the all is gonna no, fail. He's dead. He's dead. Wow. Because the particle Drone beam has more range and his commander has more speed. And GG. That's it. That is game. Wow. One and a half minutes. I think that's the shortest game I've casted ever. Yeah, this is definitely a short game. But particle beam. Particle beam. <laughs> that particle beam. Yeah, well, it's actually, more you know, range than something the... kind of silly. I don't actually cut up my YouTube videos every game. I cut them up every series. So I only okay. do the welcome zero K fans at the beginning of a series. Otherwise it'll sound weirdly cut off, but I think I might just end up cutting it without actually chopping off anything from the ends. Oh yeah, sure. I don't know. It's just, I'm still trying to figure out how to best to edit the videos. I'll be doing it tomorrow though. Cause I've got stuff to do this evening. Yeah. Okay. What, what time is it in, uh, in Canada now? Right now it's anywhere from 4 PM to 8 30 PM. <laughs> Newfoundland is weird like that. No, I'm 4. I'm at 4 p.m. I'm furthest west, but Newfoundland furthest east is 8.30. Oh, because okay. they have a half time zone. Ah, uh, it's midnight here. Ah. Uh, well, hopefully you're not waking anyone up. Oh, no. Not at all. Okay. I. Oh, yeah. Everyone's telling me in the chat to turn on your mic. I've actually been turning down your Skype in my side in the software mixer. So I wouldn't worry about it too much. I mean, maybe this will work? I don't know. Uh, I don't know. Uh, okay, well... I can turn down my mic, but I think it's better to do it at your side. Yeah, I'm doing it on my side. You're sounding weirdly soft. I think I think this is good. Okay. Yeah, my mic was slightly... dropped a bit. Okay, yeah, it's hard for me to tell, because I can't tell... I can tell by looking at the meter on OBS, mm -hmm. but I can't tell by... Anything else? Okay, they're saying it's good. Okay, perfect. So it's Drone against Google Frog in second game. Uh, drone has to win twice to uh, go through. Mm -hmm. And I, I favor uh, Drone this, on this map. I, well, Red Comet, you did say that Google Frog does not like maps like Red Comet. Oops. Okay, fine, it's gonna update. Uh, it's not that Google Frog doesn't like him, I think Drone is better on him. Well, he's an enough. old BA player, and BA has grinded down these types of games to a science. Oh, yeah, yeah. He BA and Red are like Comic Catcher Redux, isn't it? Yeah, and Red Comet. And Red Comet. Okay, sorry, the background music's too loud for you. Anyway, yep, those two. Anyway, game on. So we are. I actually should have been. Can it sound right properly? Okay. All right, there we go. Game has started. Drone, southwest corner, playing light vehicles. Against another light vehicle, could it, wouldn't have expected much else. Would have been nice to see tanks. 
It would have, because tanks are really cool in this map. Tank versus yeah. light vehicle is a great matchup, but nope. Not, not today. Light vehicle on light vehicle. What does Google Frog have so, going for him right now? Well, drone. I see multiple darts for uh, re uh, drone. Yep. And I also see that he's a bit behind the metal. Or was. Actually, he's starting to get ahead. No, Google Frog is ahead. Never mind. We are. Yeah, Google Frog definitely focusing more on metal. Drone focusing more on defense. He's worried about getting attacked. Rightly so, but not by much. In fact. Google Frog not producing very much. It looks like he's focusing entirely on early defense. I think Temporarily dropping production. Look, Google Frog is idling with uh, his factory and his uh, constructor. Well, I think what he's trying to do is just build up with his commander as quickly as possible. Both built two turrets. Uh, drone already uh, accessed his second patch of me me uh, metal. Yep. Spots. Second so pair, and Google Frog is slightly behind now. Google Frog could yeah. jump in, though. I mean, he could use that to speed it up the walk-in. Yeah, that's he's gonna have uh, to. what uh, they're good at. And he's not doing that, though. I'm surprised. Nobody morphed? Do I, do I see that correctly? No, uh, drone morphed. Drone. To energy cell. Okay, E-cell beam laser support comm. Not a surprising choice on this map. The usual stuff. Now, you can also see how drone uses his darts to keep track of his opponent's army. And only... Probably will only make an army when he needs to. Oh yeah, he's going for masons entirely. You're getting a couple scorches here and there. Now he will just sacrifice uh, economy in for more economy. So he just I'll sacrifice the left part, and then I'll get twice as much on the right side. Yeah, whereas Google Frog is going very heavily it's for fun. an early raid force. Exactly, it's just the um, I expand fast and you can kill me uh, approach. Yeah, I think Google Frog might be going for a comm snipe at this point. Although he's going to lose comm one of snipe. his... Ah. No, he's... Ow. Oh. Is he going to micro this right? Yes, he is. Google Frog gets out of that, but... On the other hand, Drone Nice with a kill on that particular metal extractor. Google Frog halfway through morphing, and he's... Oh, nice oh, kill. Oh, no, getting rid turrets. of the... Yeah, That's that why you want to have uh, laser turrets. <laughs> I can't light vehicles, yeah. I don't know if... I guess Google Frog expected Cloaky, because that's the only reason I can see if he's using defenders. And look, 21 metal against 40. Oh, oh boy, man. I love these type of games. I, uh, okay, play, Google, playing Frog going for, Google Frog's going for a drone. Has no defenses here. No, he's not. What? Google Frog's moving away from the comms. He has scorches. He, he will live. No, but three scorches. That's enough for a comm dive. I guess a support comm? A level one support comm won't survive that. Uh, he has scorches and darts near if he wants to. Oh, that's true. They are near, but I think... I've seen this happen enough times that it usually, once you get three, maybe four scorchers... What? What happens if he sees him coming, he starts to retreat towards the turret and uh, incoming scorches, and if he gets chased, he kills the uh, the attackers. Yeah, but there isn't a whole His lot of commander time. will go down to 50% health, but he'll live and he'll just kill, win the game from there on. Look okay. at how quickly Drone oh, is uh, yeah. getting uh, metal income. He's on 27 metal already. He, his energy is not keeping up, though. Um, that is true. That is a very good point. And you see, he... he, he Spent a few metal, little metal on armies early on, just those two darts. And by taking those constructors earlier, he's now doubling his opponent's economy. And Google Frog did not recognize or match uh, the move. No, he didn't. Unfortunately, he didn't raid it out. He could go to the north too, as Drone is. And Google yeah. Frog does see this coming though. He is going. Uh, all those turrets are just wasted defense. metal. Uh, turrets in your base like this are. Just uh, all giving up a lost position. Well, I think one LLT would be fine. Yeah, one, but not three or four yeah, like three he's doing now. Three defenders is going to be a bit too much, but one late it's, Lotus it's, would be good. Yeah, it, it was especially a panic in the move. south here, where the Scorch is attacking, and it's another attack here. But no, the Scorch are attacking. Able to get away, but Google Frog does not micro his Scorcher properly, letting the retreat happen. Yeah, it's <laughs> the time, single Scorch it keeps. Uh, oh, there's a center the battle too. <laughs> yeah. And a north attack as well, a dark coming in the north. A laser turret will finish it, though. That's not going to help much. No problem at all. More coming in here, and Google Frog not microing while Drone is. Drone is doing a lot better micro for his Scorchers. Yeah. Much Flash better micro. at that. I was actually playing as Drone the other day, and yeah, matching up his Scorcher micro is definitely a tricky thing to do. He's good at it. You have to really pay attention. Yeah, yeah you really have. 
Oh, if you go, he's going to lose that combat with Constructor, is he? No. No, but it doesn't matter. It's <laughs> yeah. Google Frog is yeah. just being contained at this point. Soft contained, mind you, but basically he has to just deal with this raiding happening all the time. He also, you might want out. to notice that um, every time when a uh, drone wins a fight, he makes more constructors instead of uh, trying to win the game by m even building more army. He's ah. saying, yeah, my army matches your now. I can add on even more economy, so... I'll oh, but he might be... He's going to be given a little bit of payback for that. Or try to, anyway. Goofrog not quite able to pull it off, though. Not able I to kill that Mason. It retreats. Retreating Scorch. Yeah, great. He has space. Yeah, this is just... You're right. Drone really does have that economy advantage. That's a really good way of going about it, too. Because That's how you play this type of map. It's it's a different mindset from that guys are getting. Guys yeah, are from map. or from things like Wanderlust because those yep. maps are small. Actually, Wanderlust might be kind of like this, but a map like Frozen Planet, for example, totally different because you have to worry more about raiding around. There's a lot more room to maneuver, and you end up or Trojan Hills as well. It's just you end up getting around, and you can't just think in terms of economy because you're gonna have stuff so far away you can't save it if it gets hit. Exactly. Also, you might notice that from this point on, from Five minutes ago, no, not five. Uh, let's say two five minutes, minutes ago. ago was the start of the game. <laughs> yeah, exactly. This <laughs> doesn't go that fast at the time. Um, he adds on a lot of turrets because yes. uh, his area gets stretched out that far, and his army at that point cannot uh, uh, defend at that point. But, but he does have a lot of constructors at that point. So, what you, instead right. of building an army with the build power at your factory, you plumb down turrets everywhere. Which should be a, be enough to match your opponent's firepower. That is definitely different, yeah. Um, but I I have seen him do that too, and that's definitely a that's an aggravating thing to fight against. Yeah, man, is that annoying to fight exactly. against? Exactly. It usually comes down to a raiding against raiding against more raiding, and hunt down down those constructors in the early game. But Google Fog didn't look do that. where they're and going. Drone is started. double. Oh, is drone reclaiming? I don't think no, Drone no, is no, even no, reclaiming. No, he, he just has twice the Nexus. He just has twice the Nexus. Google Frog, however, is reclaiming. A yeah. little bit. He has a reclaimed field of his own, but that's all he has going for him. It's so huge. It's Lotus in the center trying to stop this, but Leveler's coming in. Drone switching off to Leveler and switching off to Banshee as well and getting Dominatrix on top of that. Now he's switching to wow. Banshees? <laughs> yeah, <laughs> he's getting Banshees on top of Leveler's on top of Dominatrix on top of Scorchers. Mm. Getting a few of them, got a couple so far. And but, uh, nice he, 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 back. He showed them to Google Frog too early, but he's already making Razor's kisses. Yeah, that's a bit of a shame. Wait, where's the Razor? Oh, there's the Razor. Yep. And light defenses are quite good against uh, Benchies anyway. Yeah, the defenders do well. The Black Dawn would have a much easier time if he was using that. Or if he switched to air and went for shadows, but nope. And speaking of switching to air, though going for vamps instead, Google Frog getting quite a few. Yep, and uh, Drone is getting uh, the troll car. Yeah, like I said, Dominatrix. Oh, boy. Another one. <laughs> Not like... I mean, last game, of course, is short, but I think Drone really just knows he can win the late game if he wants to. He wanted to finish early last time. It didn't quite pan out, but this time, we're showing he knows his late game stuff. Yep. He's almost tripling... Uh, no, not... Uh, for not a second, quite. I thought he was tripling the economy. But it's double. He was reclaiming something. He was, but it's more a matter of, look at all the map space. Like, he has three quarters of the map. Google Frog has hardly any. I don't know if Google Frog even has an angle from which he could cut through. He has no uh, assault units. He has a couple of Ravagers, but that's about it. I guess you could could run in a uh, horde of Scorches through the south. That's about it. It's not. It's the worst defended, but even then, I'm not sure how well it will work. Google Frog, nice use of a stiletto, coming in with the Scorchers to deal with these Levelers. That's all he's got. And the Vamps trying to get rid of the Banshees, but it's not going to be enough. The Levelers able to run away, though. Disarm, not EMP, but that's not enough. The Levelers die, and the Scorchers starting to get capped, but... Not completely. However, the Banshees... Pinch King taken out by the Scorchers. Well, yeah, okay, there we go. Think about gunship against Scorchers. <laughs> yeah, capture the vamp. Go. <laughs> Not quite. Nope, that vamp didn't quite capture. Oh, but the Scorcher is. One of the Scorchers is captured. And it killed two. Oh, my goodness. That was... Drone just got rid of three of Google Fox Scorchers for free. Yeah, not for 400 metal. Okay. Or 420. How much is it today? It is 420. Yes. That is the current market price of the Dominator. <laughs> the forecast is going to be to go up. 
<laughs> and <laughs> yeah, I don't keep up with the prices. Yeah, don't worry. It's kind of hard to follow it. It's like day by day thing. Very speculative. Yeah. <laughs> but that's the case with uh, all the units, I guess. <laughs> Although I think that the Cloaky Bot has stayed pretty uh, uh, stable. Well, Tick was increased in cost slightly before the range nerf. But other than oh. that, yeah. It went from 100 to 120 uh, or something. Yep. Oh, great. Dante, I love to see that. I love well, 10 minutes into the game. Wow, Drone really has been taking an economy. He's really... Oh, my goodness. I have not seen yeah. this before at a 20-minute mark. This is the first time I've seen it this early. But I'm not surprised. And half a dozen dominators... Oh, my goodness. And Tridents, too, just that in case. That Stiletto is going to get captured, I'm afraid. No, he's not going, even going to try. He's not going for it, and that's fine. But, man, what does he got to do to get rid of that? Impalers, I guess. I don't think I can think of. Uh, I don't know. I've, I'd uh, snipe it with uh, shadows and overwhelm it with darts. Yeah, that would make sense. Just d get them into reload mode and then kill them everything else. Yeah, that's what you do. And that's what's happening, actually. It's exactly what's happening. Google Frog knows the oh, stuff. Oh, yeah, and the, the metal extractor being enough. captured before. Did you notice that? The metal extractor was, was captured it? in the north before it was constructed, and Google Frog kept building it. Yeah, that, that's how the, uh, the construction works. That is pretty yeah. hilarious. And there we go, the darts are coming in to distract the dominatrices and doing their job. Actually doing yeah, a nice job, too. That's how it works. Now you need to push with LTs and keep your dominatrixes uh, close. And then, or you put uh, levelers in between your... Uh... Yeah, that's not going to work, though. Not at this point. Not enough. There are levelers, but the Ravagers are coming in to finish those off. And at the same time to the south, Drone's commander getting sniped. Not that it matters at this point, <laughs> but his commander's going down. Google Frog finally what? takes out the commander when it does no, not idea. matter. What he was not doing the least. there. That drone is just trolling now. Look at what he's... Oh, yeah, and Dante. And more dominatrices. If he was trolling, I'd see a crow. I'm just waiting for Google Frog to make an uh, annihilator now in the middle of the map. Actually, that might save his butt. <laughs> yeah. Against <laughs> no, that Dante, that might not be a bad choice. <laughs> not that he has the energy grid near it, but still. Yeah, it would need a fusion or something. Oh, no, but the, not enough darts near the Dominic sees. Stiletto, however, disarming a couple of them, but those two were in reload mode anyway. Still, some of them are going down, but more of them are capturing. This is still not going for a drone, but at the same time, the Dante coming in, doing its thing, getting rid of Google Frog's commander with no issues. Hello. Light defenses against the Dante. That's not a pretty sight. It is not. You need a lot of LTs to take down a Dante. And... Yeah, that's not going to work. Admittedly, it's at three quarters health, which isn't saying much, but it's still at three quarters health. Google Frog's attack to the north is doing a pretty decent job, but those dominatrices. Those dominatrices. Why? <laughs> of course, if Google Frog gets his own dominatrices, he captures the dominatrices. And it says a dominatrix chain of captured dominatrices. Does it work like that? I have no idea. I've never tried. And the I Razor getting capped as well. Takes out the trident. No, it doesn't quite take out one of the tridents first. Drone is moving for the kill. I think this is game. Google Frog is going to have a last stand, but that's there's not much you can do. This Dante might go down to the Ravager. No, they're not positioned properly. They're not going to get it in time. Yep, this is it. GG. 1-1. One, one. Will be, uh, yes. One's Google really, Frog I'm really curious that. which map. Oh, it's the letter coming maybe, out. Maybe Google Frog will take a water map. Maybe. Or are they disallowed? I don't know if it's disallowed. It's all featured 1v1, and I think there are a couple of featured 1v1 monitors. Like, Rapids is featured, and I think... I think... What was it called? I've forgotten Crossing. That's also featured, but that's not a water map. Uh, Ar Didn't, no, uh, something Valley. Flooded Valley, that's it. That'd be the one you'd probably go for. And there's game! GG! Google Frog is... 1-1. This is even match. So we shall be seeing... Once we get the next one, that'll be it. Oh, Sands of War. That's another one. That's actually the screenshot that's up right now. Sands of War, I think, is also featured. Not 100% sure, though. Uh, I'm, I'm looking up something. Um, looking at the featured maps? Yeah, and something about water. I'm not sure if it was this tournament or another one. Oh, come on, Internet. Give me the... Okay, thank you. Oh, yeah, Google Frog pointing out in the chat. He's completely thrown off by that early rating. I just completely oh. knocked him for a loop. And on top of the 
constructors being built behind. That's big deal there. Really big deal. No, it uh, w doesn't mention anything about uh, the map types. It doesn't. It should. Nope. Oh, on the on the tournament. Yes. No, he's not mentioned that. Just featured one v one maps. But Titan uh, was the choice. Titan is the choice. Why? Well, Titan is is somewhere in between of a big flat map and a big position play yeah, style Yeah, there are map. choke points. I yeah. do see that. It's it's like. Oh, just pointing out. There's. there's a, sorry, I just noticed the forum thread for it after QB threw in the image of himself. Well, the Madoka Kyubei. You end up seeing a bunch of images from the show, either from the show or from fan art stuff, of Kyubei being killed. Hmm. Or damaged, or things like that. It's like... I don't, I don't think I, I know the show, so... Uh, oh, it's a good show. You should watch it. Awesome show. It's, it's show a cartoon, it. right? Yes. Okay. It's not for kids, by the way. Although it might look like it's for It kids. looks like it. It's not... Okay. And it's awesome. Anyway, on to the third oh, game. Oh, here. Okay, never mind. On to the third game, and we are going to have, like I said, Titan Duel. Titan Duel it is. Google Frog in the Northwest and Drone in the Southeast. No factories in it. Morphing off. Let's see, that Recon Com. He wants to make his factory closer to the center. Yes, a little bit. Both going for light vehicles. <laughs> Save no about a second or two seconds of move or movement. Now it's Goofrog with the aggression with two darts. Yep, and then moving on from there. Followed by dart. Followed by on this map, and who knows? I think it's possible to start out with a constructor on this map and uh, hold off those two uh, darts. Yeah, it's. Yeah, look, look at if. if if Drone manages to Please. defend this. Oh, but Drone lost his dart. He needs to... Google Frog oh, needs to raid it... in from here. That's all he has going for him. And he's he's sort of doing that. Sort he of already doing has that. his constructor out and already taking his fourth max while Google Frog is still moving. He's making additional energy. He still hasn't reached his fourth max yet. That's not additional energy. This is his commander. His commander morph is an E-cell. Google Frog's morph is not even done. I don't think yeah. that one has an E-cell, though. I think that one's the one with the think... particle beam. We'll see uh, uh, jump start at the economy uh, from drone again. Yeah, and then but from here, scorchers. And four darts coming in as well. Yeah, he sees those pain. scorchers coming, and that's so important, but now, because now he can uh, prepare for those. Mm -hmm. He doesn't even need to kill anything with the darts. Just see those maxes are not taken yet, like this one. He says, yeah, there is no constructor here. I'm, I'm safe for now. Oh my goodness, that's... Wow, I think Drone is... He's certainly put himself in an advantageous position. I can see that easily. But he uh, He still needs to take care of two Scorches. Um, he does, he but he has two Scorchers, scorch. and... We've seen Google before that... Just wasted this opportunity by not moving any further did, immediately. And we know that Drone has better Scorcher Micro than Google Frog does. Uh, even, let's just assume they are of equal skill micro well, it doesn't matter uh, at this point. There's three Scorchers to two. <laughs> Exactly, and there's a commander to the left. Yeah, but looks like Google Frog's gonna try. He's taking a. He has three, and he get, keeps reinforcing from this point, this point. Now he needs to resend Scorchers to this position. Yeah, immediately, to like now, now, to slow down that uh, constructor. But he's not doing that. Drone is just letting that happen. Although, actually, wait, no, he uh, is. He's going for the fact. That can't be right. He's not no, going to the factory quite yet. Drone but needs to put down energy now. He's going for the commander, I think. Yeah, that's exactly what he's doing. And he is he's gonna go for comps knife. He sees it. He's going for it. No, 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 he's not. Oh no, he, no he's that, he's avoiding it. Wisely avoiding it. At, at this no, point, he's trying to sneak in. Playing as drone, you do not want to try comp snipe now. You just want to match your opponent's army and expand faster because you have more constructors. And more map control. Once again, yeah, that, he's that's keeping, how you play out map he control. He is keeping Google Frog in a corner. Oh, perfect! Killing ah, its torture. Ah, that's micro Get for the you. He's... No, that's lack of. It's not micro. It's the lack of attention of Google Frog. He that's didn't true. see it. That's true. That wasn't even micro. If it was micro, we would have seen a lot more weaving. Exactly. It was just Google Frog wasn't noticing that was happening. So, 
but... And now it's uh, yeah. Drone's ah. fault by not microwing his Scorcher, and he lost it. He did, but... Didn't kill the command. Didn't kill the constructor. That's a waste. He could have, he or could maybe have. he could have tried. Oh, and Google Frog, he he's splitting up. He's trying to keep. I think he's trying five to against four, but uh, five against four, but out of position. Those three in the back are not going to work out. Uh, no, it's two against four. Perfect. Oh, Almost. but no, it's not. Wow, that's actually not a bad. Well, he traded two for two. He could have gotten three. Yeah. Google Frog could have gotten a third one there. If he clumped up those five instead of, he wouldn't have let them. Get split on that uh, yeah, little. Yeah, he would have had it. I bump. guess that was unintentional. I thought he might have been going for a flank or something, but you have to no. pay attention to so much details uh, on these types of games in this phase of the game, that stage of the game. Well, yeah, because the whole physics thing. There's so much there. So many little things. Ideally, you want to micro everything manually, and, and, and up to this point, you can. There's not much else to do. Yeah, because this point, this is kind of where it's a matter of getting your army big enough by not letting it die. And then once it's big yeah. enough, then you can build an army and you'll have enough economy to just pump out units and if they die, who cares? Yeah. The thing I don't like at this point is that drone does not see if or where an attack might be coming from. He doesn't have darts on his opponent's map and he just finished his radar, so he was in the dark for about almost a minute. So he could yeah. have been attacked over the right flank, he wouldn't have seen it if that was the case. Actually, he but could have Google Frog not just been didn't attacked. Do. Google Frog could have gone over to the northeast and taken those metal extractors for free. I mean, now he'll be spotted. No, that would have been taken. Uh, we're talking about time frames of 10, 15 seconds here. Oh, that, okay, that never mind then. I'm just thinking the constructor, if you notice the radar range is not on the mexes, but it is where the constructor will be. So it would yeah. see the constructor going through, but it wouldn't see the metal extractors. But it looks like Google Frog figures drone is going to be going for that, and Google Frog doesn't see it. He's blind to what drone's doing. Yeah, he's putting. They just put up a radar on the left side, but not enough to see the right side. No, that's going to be a problem. They uh, oh, are equal he, in metal uh, now, though. Yeah, Google Frog is actually not doing a bad job of making sure he can't expand. Oh, he does have an idle con. That's a big thing right now. This command, this constructor here, is not moving. It should be. If for nothing else, then get out of the way. But it is not. Google Frog's not expanding behind this, and drone is. Ay. Drone has his energy set up for the future. Yes. Oh, nice. He's got the whole grid nicely. Actually, not quite. He has one more. There we go. Getting that one last thing to connect it all together. Yep. And now he just needs to fill up his energy bar. And that's not going to... Well, actually, Google Frog is close. He's much closer to Overdrive than Drone is, but... Yeah, Drone's much better economy going for him. Um, at this point, I'm wondering if... Who and is going to change to another factory? Well... And, or if they want to add, in, add on uh, different type of units like uh, oh, leveler from, leveler from Google Frog. He's the first. He's only built one though. Two. Oh, has he built two? Yeah, he's built two, and Drone is building one. So there is a bit of a switch there, but it looks like I mean a map like this, you don't really see a whole lot of levelers to begin with. Like it's a lot mm, of raiding nothing. going around and defense coming in for Google Frog. Oh, in the north side of the map, there is going to be a pretty big massacre. I think drones. No, no drones doesn't have this. He just barely doesn't have this. Has to retreat. Deal some damage nah, though. It, it's not enough. Three scorches or five scorches. At this point, you need more. Yeah, you really do. You, you, you can use them to scout and push your constructor back a couple meters, but you cannot do a big attack. No, but the thing is that if you do have. If you do have that, it's at least oh, get them out of position. Oh, come on, they're getting hit by two laser turrets. That's bad. I think what Drone really should have done there was, as, as he was doing that, attack from the center. Because he'd pulled no, out a bunch of Google Frog's forces. There are too many turrets on the map to make attacks with small units work at this point. Right, but I think Google Frog still got distracted. The, he still the, moved his units out of the position. The most important somewhere. thing to note at this moment is that Drone is trying to take the corner before Google Frog is. Yeah. But, Oh, this, yes, the northeast corner, you're right. And he's doing that too. Though this Lotus he, is hardly built, but. He has had his max for quite a while now. And yeah. he's even trying to take the other corner as well. <laughs> trying to take both corners. Try, actually, Google Frog stopped that. He, but Geothermal Plant looks like it's going to be built up as well, and probably Go Drone is going to make either a pylon or just a line of. Well, he would have liked to make a line of power generators, I'm sure. Google Frog stops that though. But at the same time, Google Frog going to the south here and. In the center drone is moving his commander in. And it's beam laser E cell, by the way. It's air for both of them. One is uh, to Google Frog is to 
bombers out already and a drone uh, just started his first. Yes, so Goofrog is going to go for the snipe. I mean, drone's commander is nice and vulnerable. And Goofrog actually knows where that is. It's in the line of sight. Yeah. Question, I'm probably going to wait for boy. four. And there it goes. That is the attack coming in there. Three bombers. Is that going to be enough? I think it might. It is. Yes, it is. It's going to be enough. Oh, no. Oh, he but jumps the, perfect. He jumps, but one of them is not, didn't drop. One of them didn't drop. There we go. Dead. Uh, Nicely done. Google Frog's last bomber did not drop it when it, sh when it shouldn't have, and that works. Not that it matters all that much. Drone did not rely that greatly on his commander. His energy economy is going to be a little bit lower, but not by much. Google Frog's in a better position than the last game, though. Slightly. But despite uh, Drone losing his commander, he's still up in economy. Okay, but he did lose his commander. However, it's a matter of... I think At this point, it's going to be destroying the defenses. Getting rid of all the static defenses as possible, and then rushing in with ground forces. That's how it usually works. Yeah. That being said, Google Frog's not really focusing on that. He's got a few bombers here and there sent around, the but he's is, not building a lot. He's dedicating so much resources to air now, he doesn't have a, a ground army at this point. He cannot no. make anything happen on the ground. Oh, no, no, he's pushing He's pushing more heavily into ground. His air is barely being invested into. And that mason in the southwest corner destroyed. Google Frog but takes still, that out nicely. Drone has the holds most of the mexes in both the corners. He does, and that... And he has a better grid. Much better grid. And northeast corner needs to take that out. Uh, wow, he has got a great grid. Although, unfortunately, he's not got the energy economy. He doesn't have enough energy in general to reliably overdrive, but he does have the grid, that's for sure. Yeah, but every point of energy you can spend on overdrive is perfect. So much better than just wasted, <laughs> like all the other TA mods. Do you remember those games where you just had to switch on and off metal makers manually? Uh, well, Subcom worked like that. But... Exactly. Or Total Inhalation or any of the Actually, other TA Evolution mods. RTS kind of works like that too. Though Evolution RTS uses energy mostly for attacking, so it's not a complete waste. But anyway, Google Frog uh, going for a surgical strike to the center, keeping some defenses just in case where drones coming in. So both players are going for major attacks. Drones bombers taking out the levelers though, or heavily damaging them. Google Frog's bombers not doing anything for drones levelers, or not yet. Attacking one of them, taking out a scorcher, not quite the best option. Drone trying to come in here. Actually, drone losing a lot of the southwest. Google Frog drone is killing all the fighters. That's perfect. Yeah, that's no, the drone thing. is air control. Yeah, drone's got it all now. The only thing he doesn't have is the southwest corner, and it looks like Google Frog did not push. He did not keep going with that scorcher push. I'm that a little a bit surprised. Decision. Really? You think so? Yeah, it's it's too big of risk. How often do you lose that army without achieving much? Fair enough. It's just there isn't anything right now. I guess we do see just more. Just take of the out game. the corner and retreat. That's what you do. Still, he Don't did... go for the main big hit and try to win the game immediately with these type of attacks. Well, he you would just have won the game pick off what you can, that. and it's it's a common theme in RTS games. I think. That's true. It's just that he would have won. Yeah, th that is the one thing. I think people point out when yeah, there are no defense, he could have won it, but I'm pretty sure it wouldn't have achieved much because there were two laser turrets and he would have been bumped to oblivion while he was. Yeah, uh, I guess that's a point. Attacked. Regardless, he did make the right choice apparently. So. And that is why I have you along, because I clearly don't <laughs> quite know as much as I should. You, you know plenty. More okay. than enough. It's just... I know more than I know. It's a bit of an oxymoron, yeah, but okay. You played these types of games a million times to, to see that, to recognize the situation, I guess. Okay. Fair enough. But anyway, I think... Oh, that's Google a nice Fox scorcher on the right side. It, yeah, that's oh, a... That's well, it was, but the thing is, the Scorch in the left center, dealing with the Ravagers not doing too much, unfortunately. Now it's reclaim time. It is reclaim time for Drone. Drone's in a happy position. Hmm. And only Drone. It looks like uh, he's going to win. Uh, at least, economy-wise, uh, uh, Google Frog is good with unit composition. Yeah, but it's a matter of how many it. units. At, at this point, Drone... Hey, Google... It's the Ravagers. And he, he's trying to bomb them out, and he's doing an okay job with that, but... He can't get too many bombers because he doesn't have air control. He has some Avengers around the map. He's got okay air presence, but air is still contested. Oh, Avengers are going down, but yep. over the defenders, that that vamp is not in a good spot. 
Neither is that bomber, though. One of the vamps goes down. The Avenger also goes down. The bomber survives. Just barely Google Frog managed to save his bomber with static defense. And gets rid of Drone's bomber. Or does he? Drone is uh, adding oh. uh, mobile anti-air now. Yeah, but Instead Drone... Of, uh, fighters. Okay, that's... Uh, uh, <laughs> Dominatrix. That's the oh, big crap. question, though. And more Dominatrixes are coming. Drone's just spamming those out oh. now. We have to keep an eye on Google Frog now. He has to make something happen. He because does. He's he on, tried. This is a lot, uh, losing position for him. Well, he cannot he, stay. Yeah, he needs to get rid of that Dominatrix immediately. And the Dominatrix is in reload mode, but not enough. That leveler trying to do what he can, but it's not target. He needs to target that Dominatrix. Gets rid of it regardless, but another one comes in. Not quite enough. The leveler is doing a decent job, but not enough. Levelers uh, don't have the damage for this. It's not that he needs to get rid of the Dominatrix. He Bar has consolidated a, a position from which you can only lose. Look at that line of turrets. I know, but it needs. To, if he bombs out this, I think he has a chance to push out of it. If it's Drone it, just does not attack from this point on, and just keeps defending turrets and fighters, then he will just win. He doesn't even have to attack at this point. Yeah. Yeah, I'm thinking Google Frog. Well, he has Google like, like this, this move with these fighters is, is not good. He could have stayed on his own ground, because Google Frog is losing at this point. Yeah, well... Drone apparently just wants to finish this maybe a bit too soon, getting a little impatient. Can't yeah, say I blame th th him. Th th that's bad. His advantage isn't big enough yet. No, I mean, it's, his economy advantage is good, but his unit advantage is... He has no. He has a unit disadvantage, by far. Google Frog is yeah, twice the army, army for cost. Almost 2k uh, behind. Most of Although that being air five units, but... fighters make up most of that, but... I think that... I really think that Google Frog... The best thing he has right now is his bombers. He needs to be making use of those continuously. And he is. He's raiding with those. He's going after some metal extractors, making sure he can... He has one shadow. The economy. He has one shadow, but that gets rid of a mechs. Yeah, that's true. I think that's one mechs every, like, 20 seconds? Just to slow Google Frog... Sorry, just to slow Drone down so Google Frog gets a bit of a chance as he takes the reclaim field. But not enough of it. Drone really has better control of that center. Yeah, drone is making uh, cons only now. I see what you mean by consolidating the position, though. Cons only and a Dante again. <laughs> That's how you do it. Yeah, drone. Static uh, or mobile, a uh, not uh, fighters. But uh, if Google Frog attacks now, I'm not sure if he realizes it, but he can make something happen now. He could. There's so much open right now. I mean, the Dante is a big threat, yes, but everything else, all these lasers, are gonna just melt against these Ravagers and Levelers. And I think I Google Frog might think realize he realizes it. Uh... He will soon if he moves his vamps close enough, but he's not. Doesn't see it. He misses. Uh, his window of opportunity is closing, <laughs> as they used to call it. Oh boy, it's closing fast. That Dante is done. His only no, chance to attack right needs now. Needs to move to the front, and then it will just <laughs> murderize all those. Uh, like, Google Frog needs to attack right now. Deal with what he can. Make sure that nothing else is constructed, because that Dante is already too late. And why is going? Google Frog going? Okay, he's trying to figure out if there's anything in that. That could have been more, done more efficiently, getting to that metal extractor point. And Google Frog, however, is keeping a decent control of the air. Crashers doing what they can. Not a whole lot of them, though, but still he's enough. He's going to lose those crashers. Yeah, the thing. Oh, going down. Stiletto nice! There we go. Now. Google Frog trying to make it happen, trying to finish this game, break out of its bad position. And nice to start with the Dominatrix, too. At the same time, Crashers are doing what they can against the Vamps. They're nice for support, but... The Dominatrix, one more Dominatrix is alive, and that is being a big threat. And Google Frog's unit's getting stuck on wreckage and having to fall back. Why is he falling back? He needs to push. He needs to keep going. There's nothing to be gained from moving back. Yeah, if, if he concedes now, he cannot... He doesn't get another chance. He has to but move. Right. I think... No, move those Ravages north and uh, hit it there. Yeah, and then sweep south. It's the only choice. If he goes to the north and then sweeps south, that'll at least that'll at least be something. But I think at this point, like north here, and then goes all the way down. Oops. Goes all the way down. Then that will do the trick, or at least be something. Of course, that does open him up to the Dante more so than he is already. He might be trying to. He doesn't know about the Dante though. Not yet. He does now. He has line of sight on the Dante. And at the same time, he does have a Scorcher rating, but it's not enough. Getting rid of that Southwest. Spamming 
Uh, dominate this now. Yeah, that's that's kind of it, isn't it? That's really his kind of game, and a lot of command, a lot of constructors too, to easily repair this Dante if needed. And the dominatrix is just not allowing Google Fox to do anything. I think he can disarm uh, the dominator, uh, the the Dante now, with yes. three. He has enough stilettos. Is he gonna go for it? One of them goes for it, and that's enough to disarm it for a little while, for a couple seconds. Is another stiletto gonna come in? It needs to. And who's? Well, that Phoenix. Whose Phoenix was that? Oh, Phoenixes are belonging. To, just whose Phoenix was that? I thought it was Google Frog had a Phoenix. Yeah, Google Frog has a Phoenix. I, I, I don't see any Phoenixes. Oh, no, no. oh right, the Napalm's on the Dante. Never mind. Oops. <laughs> yeah, Still. Yeah. Still, I don't need to come in. And no, it's too late. It's too late. Drone has this. I think so. Yeah. It's it's done. There's, Game over. There's still a, a big swarm of Scorches waiting there. Yeah, that Scorcher swarm isn't going to do too much. I mean, Google Rock, if he attacks it, north with, with it, from a micro, a he could get rid of the Dominatrixes, but not the Dante. No. Unless he, if he disarms, maybe, but he has no stilettos left. He's not using them. That's the thing. Google Rock has not been using the units he has. He's been letting them just fly around. Yeah, he couldn't. There's a lot of... Uh, he has six of those, so... It's, what are they called? Uh, crashes running around? Yeah, sure, but I mean, one good... One good stun in the Dante and on the Dominators is he could rush in with the Scorchers and tear them all apart. Nah, uh, he, he would... They were, would just be trading. Uh, and that I guess. gives uh, Drone the game. But wait, how would he be trading? If the Disarm happens, wouldn't that cause nothing to be killed? But that's not the only thing that's running around. Oh, I see what you mean. You trade the stilettos for the ground force. All of this, and that's uh, game. That's match. Yeah, GG. Well, well, well played by John. Wow. I really like the way he plays this out. This is how you play flat maps. Indeed. All you and aspiring uh, zero K players, take notes. <laughs> yeah, Google Frog has gone on. He's going to the bronze match. And oh, there's a bronze match. Yes, he's against Lowry. Lowry. So the next thing is me, Google Frog, and Lowry fighting for third place. And then Drone and Randy fighting for domination. Okay. Well, assuming the players agree to that. Hmm. Oh, they want to play my map. We. Map our shores? No, Wanderlust. <laughs> oh, it's a good map. I like that map. No, you uh, I think it's, uh, it plays nice, but it looks awful. You think it looks awful? I think it looks pretty good. No, the it's texture not the best is looking uh, map, but it's not bad. I need uh, another program to uh, generate textures. What are you using? Uh, Carrara? Oh, I never used that. But uh, I used a, what was it called, an 8 bit. Height map when I should have used 16 bits, oh. or I used 16 bit when I should have used 32 bits, and that 32 bit makes it all but 16 pixely. bit, yeah, yeah. 16 bit height map is necessary. Yeah, it's 8 bit. I couldn't use values up to 255. Okay, well, it's those players don't take breaks, don't they? They aren't going to be taking too much of a break, I don't think. I think it's going to be run in the next game. I might need a break. I need some water, <laughs> I think. What about the casters? <laughs> yeah, I need a bit of water. I'm going to just say don't go. I don't think they care. Man, I'm I really liked the last game. That was a good one. The, the start of the game, when Drone makes a constructor straight from the start and Google Frog doesn't, and yeah. then he manages to hold off those first darts, then suddenly he's running expansion from two paths, one with his commander, one with his constructor, and Google Frog didn't. And from that point on... Yeah, Drone really knows how to make that expansion work. Yeah, and then... He's been learning. The, sc the scary thing is then when you see Randy do it, he just plays that same style, but then twice as good as Drone does. So, <laughs> okay, game starting. Uh, we don't get a I'm break. I'm really looking forward to the to the finals when they can do that. Yeah, being the way their styles work out, I've that'll be cool.